Hello? <laughs> oh gosh, is this working? Hello? Oh, hey, Ethan. Yo, hey, Gideon. How's I can going? only hear your your game. I can only hear the audio from Wait, actually? Pokemon coming through. Oh, well, let's fix that. Uh... It's very pretty, though. <laughs> there, how's that? Oh, there you go. I got you. Got, you're you're here. Okay, we're present. We're present. <laughs> we're in the moment. Holy this is a, man! Just two boomers playing Pokemon. I I think I I might beat you for the most boomerish here. I mean, I didn't teach you how to use Discord, but uh... <laughs> it's been a long time. That's that's my excuse. Anyway, we're here now. How are you? I love it. I'm good. How are you? G good, man. I am uh, just gonna put you in my headphones so I can uh, put this phone d -d down. Sweet. Yeah, I gotta learn how to use my headphones. That's the Ooh, that's always the tricky bit. I like it. Boomers united. Great. Absolutely. I'm gonna try and join the thing. Nice. Have you played? Like, oh wait, hold, hold up, hold up, hold up. I am not even online at the moment. Oh. Therefore, okay. it is likely that you will not be able to use my link code. Well. I'm gonna disband the group. Sweet, that's yes. Okay. I'm going to. I was I was wondering why this link code was so easy. Mm. Usually they're much more complicated and uh, more, okay. more simple digits. Yeah, cause like I was I was trying to sign in. And it's like, oh, you can't join. And then I was like, oh, I'm offline. I'm so. Yeah, we're we're figuring it out. Slowly but surely, <laughs> we will be. Playing the Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, yeah. Now, I think. Okay. Can you say something? Something. You're in your head. You're in my headphones. There oh, we go. nice. I'm in your ear holes. Perfect. You, yes, absolutely. It's uh, <laughs> a post and personal. <laughs> ASMR. <laughs> This is true. So I, I think I recently learned that ASMR only works for like some people. Like there's some people who like respond to it. Oh, okay. Like more so than other people. It's not. It's not everybody. Not, not everybody gets the gets the goosebumps and the tingly. Not everybody's getting the dopamine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is it. Okay, sweet. So I'm online. Here's the link code. G as in Gideon. H as in horse. F as in friends, zero, V for victory, D for David. Okay. All right, let's 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 try this. Oh, okay. J just, the, it ends with D. <laughs> I was like D four, and then I was like David. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. G, H. Yep. F? Yeah. Zero? Yeah. V? Yeah. D. Sick. All right. I just caught a you cricket tot, and now I'm gonna gonna hop in this Heck B. Yeah. All right. Uh, so did you beat the Elite Four now? Like you're all donezo or what? Not yet. So I actually ended up playing online with uh, some friends from TikTok last night, oh, and sick. we just did a bunch of terror raids. Mm. And this is what I'm gonna suggest for us to do. Okay. If we just do a bunch of terror raids. You'll get a bunch of EXP candies, <gasps> and we can do some. We can do some that are like we'll get you some like medium and large EXP candies mm -hmm. that will uh, that will set you up to level up your Pokemon real fast. Oh, dude, real fast. I love that. That sounds great. Right, right. It's. Uh, I feel like this is the only reason why I've been like so efficient in playing Pokemon right now is because. My roommate Davis did the same for me. Like we just played a bunch of terror raids, and he got me a bunch of like medium and large EXP candies. And so the first couple gyms were a walk. Sick. It was great. Yeah. Cause I heard they don't like they don't like scale the levels in the gyms. Is that right? Yes. Like you have to beat them in order because. It won't just, hey, Swan Dizzle. Hey. All right, here we go. We're setting out together. So, like, it's open world, but it's like, well, you kind of need to do it this way. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And it's it's funny because you kind of, like, they don't tell you that you need to do all of the challenges, right? They're giving you, like, three different missions, essentially. Yeah. And they're like, you can do it whatever order that you want. 
but actually you have to do all the Titan challenges in order to like explore the world fully. You could do it without, but it just makes life really hard. Like you kind of you got to do everything. Okay. You can't just do the gym. Gotcha. Yeah. That's good. All right. So uh, where are we? Mezagosa, hey. Mamma hey. Mia. Look at you. Okay. How do you spin like that? You just, How are you just do it real fast. Just dance moves. I didn't think this was gonna happen, but here we are. Whoa! Oh, oh, whoa! Nice, dude. Whoa. Very stylish. Ooh. would be so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna puke. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that to me? Wait, who'd you pick as a starter? Uh, Fue Coco. Fue Coco. Yeah, who'd you pick? Brilliant. I got quick wave ball. Nice. Right, uh, Qu Quaxley, who's now Quick Wave Ball. Wait, who's uh, the duck? Do I have... You got the duck one. The duck, yes. But currently, I'd be traveling with this monster. Oh! Check out my Pyroar. Yeah, he's from. Uh, what is. Is he a Sun and Moon guy? I can't remember. I think so. I have no idea. I haven't played Pokemon since Emerald, so he's <laughs> new. I, I play a fun game every time I run into a new Pokemon. Like, is this a Pokemon that's. Normal to tell there or not? <laughs> That's awesome. I uh, I just evolved my dude this morning. Nice. So he, he looks like Wait, a clown, he, really. He's the sec he's the second part. Does he have like the egg on his head now? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's so confusing. I'm not sure what they were going for with that. Like the crocodile who's best friends with the the crow, but it works out. <laughs> okay, and. Uh, What's he, wait, wait, do you have Violet or Scarlet? Yeah, we got Violet. Violet. My man, my Dope. man, Professor Turo, let's go. Okay, uh, I'm gonna check my map and see where the nearest raid is. Okay. Oh, I've got two over two to the west. So I'm gonna head west, and you can follow me, or you can also just explore your map, and eh. then we can invite each other to raids. Oh, I see. Okay. From all over the map. Yeah, it doesn't. Mm. So as soon as I enter a raid. You'll get like a little notification, mm. and then you can hit Y to join, and we'll jump and we'll take down some Parastalaz Pokemon. Dope. Some bedazzled Pokemon. Be yeah, they very much are bedazzled. <laughs> right? So, all right. Is this the? Uh... Oh, okay. So I got a, a four-star electric Dratini. Whoa! Do you think I can actually beat anything? Like I have, well, I haven't done a single gym yet. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing. I think we should. I think we should try this sure. and see if you would be able to help at all. <laughs> Why not? Might as well. Right. Let's let's see what we can do here. Sure. Uh, I'm gonna select my uh, my electric type that has a ground move. Mm. Uh, actually, hold up. Can I teach him earthquake before? I just want to. I just want to go in here with the maximum opportunity for us to. Just... Sick. There's just like shinxes just walking around. This is sick. All over. Isn't it cool? Did you play Arceus? I did. I did. Nice. Okay. Because I feel like I, having not played Arceus, was very excited to play an open world Pokemon game. Mm -hmm. Like the the concept of being able to w walk into Pokemon and see like where they all are, is very cool to me. For sure. You know, I when I play Pokemon, I don't give a heck about like battling, to be honest. I just love catching oh, yeah? them all. So what was so, so great in Ar Arceus is that uh, like you didn't even have to battle. You could just whip the balls at them and they see if it sticks or not. It was awesome. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah. That's good. You can't you can't do that in this game, unfortunately. That mm -hmm. sucks. Mm -hmm. All right, we're gonna challenge this as a group. We're gonna see if I can take down this four star. Um, this four star <laughs> okay. it's gonna fill in our party so it'll be myself and like two others did you get the invitation oh uh i'm just sending a shinx that i nicknamed zippy boy uh Ooh, nice. into here and then i should get the notification here now so you, because if you were in a battle when the notification was sent out you won't see it pop up on your screen you have to go to the poker portal so hit x Go to the Porca Portal and hit Terra Raids, and then you'll see an invitation. Oh, man, you are you are in depth. I just I just learned that last night. <laughs> nice. Okay, here it is. Yeah, perfect. Maybe you, Juan Dizzle's gonna join. Oh, I think this is a Dragon Air. He's got the little wing wingy oh, ears. Oh yeah, you're right. He's, he's not, he is not a Dratini. He's a middle boy. A All right. Okay. Ready to go? All ready, ready to go. To go. 
Oh, you got the you got the frog thing. I got the frog thing. So it was a uh, tad tadpole. Yeah. Pole tad. I don't know. Uh, I think tadpole. Okay. Tad tad bulb is what's his name. He was tad bulb, tad and now bulb. he has belly bolt. But uh, I have fondly named him Bill Nye. Because <laughs> why not, right? <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. That's sweet. What's your boy Coco? Uh, his name is uh, Monchi because he's got a big ass mouth. I like it. I like it. He's a monster. He's gonna monch. Yeah, he's gonna monch. Oh yeah. He's gonna monch. Monch has got a monch. Oh, this is very shiny. He is very well. He's not. He, yes, he's very shiny. Well, he's not a shiny. Yes, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Don't get it twisted. <laughs> oh, okay. Maybe, maybe we'll be all right. <laughs> we might be all right. The kids are all right. <laughs> I really need to take off. So I've got um, a Nefrigus on Goldeneye, which is like great in a regular battle, but it takes extra time mm. in the raid, and it's not good. It's not good. Nice. Oh, mm -hmm. oh shoot. Did you get one shot? I, I did, and then uh, now I'm back. Hey, I'm probably going to get one shot again. If I cheer, does that like increase stats? Maybe I should do that. Uh, you know, uh, if you cheer, it'll heal us. Oh, sick. Yeah. Oh, I don't want that. Let me, no, come on, don't play. Yes, good. <laughs> All I've got on so. Belly Bolt is my antidote to any electric type that I ever go up again. Mm. Um, because he's resistant to electric type attack. And uh, I have one mud ground type that I've got him, which oh. isn't super helpful. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. it's mud. It's it's mud slap. It's not the greatest ground type. <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. It's like uh, it's kind kind of like um like a quag quagsire situation. Except yeah. I guess you're now you're electric. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. What does Dragon Man do? What does it do? Special attack? Hey, that's sword dance. I don't know. I don't know. That's sword dance? I think, I, I think, I think he got it. I think he got it. So if we can get through his... Uh... Do, do you think we can do it? The timer's going. The timer's going down. The timer, I am not optimistic about this. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> do we actually know what level they are? Or it's just like a... Uh, it's a, star. This is a four star raid, it's probably a level 40. Oh, shucks, okay. Okay, you know what? Uh, I'm just gonna try paralyzing and using an electric type move because uh, he paralyzes electric. Oh. oh no, okay. He, he released all of his energy into the other cabin. <laughs> Does that mean it's gone? You can't it's do gone, it? Yeah. No, you can't. Yeah, so we, we lost. What? Oh, I know. man. So sad. Okay, my next question is, do, yeah. do the badges still work the same way in that, uh, like, like certain Pokemon after a certain level, like, won't obey you if you don't have enough badges? Is that still? Yes. Correct. Oh, boy. All right. Correct. You need to have Pokemon uh, that... Like yeah, you need you need to beat the gyms in order to get the Pokemon to respect you. <laughs> oh okay, <laughs> okay. Because I was just gonna say like I could just hop on a Pokemon home and like load up like some some thick ass boys, but uh, oh, maybe yeah, not yeah, then. Yeah, but you not not yet. Not okay. Okay. Uh, oh okay, this is a four star fighting type Don fan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah yeah, I think we could do this one because I have a I've got a Gardevoir that is high enough level to like. I won't be able to one-shot it, but I'll do some serious damage. Like, better than my mud slap okay. every single time. Let's try it. Let's try this one. Sick. I feel like I'm, I'm uh, leading you into a, a war that is maybe like re I'm recklessly leading you into war. Is that's how I feel right now? I'm I'm here for it. Sign me up, dude. Conscription. Right, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, why to say, join? Say goodbye, say, say goodbye to your loved one. Yep. See, see, you, see you, mom and dad. We're, We're gonna go bye. fight the Pokemon. <laughs> yeah. And is this like the Dawn fan, or is that like? Because the, there's like a prehistoric one now, isn't there? 
Yeah. Okay. Uh, I don't want to give away too much. How I, much have you? How much you know already? I just I just know that he's like one of the legends or something. Um, he's not like a legendary Pokemon. Right, but like a like a Titan or something, right? Like it, the Ar Arvin or yeah, whatever yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah, he was yeah. like, dude, get this, go hunt. Or no, no, it was um, it was the professor, right? He's like, dude, go get this Dawn fan for me. Or something. Oh. I can't remember. It's like at oh, the very maybe. beginning, somebody was like, there's some. Did they tell you thing. about it? Like the Dawn man? I think so. <laughs> Look at him. Wow. You... Yeah. This is regular, but you got the cool hat. I could... Oh, no. <laughs> I chose the wrong Pokemon. <laughs> you got fire type? Yeah. Oh, we'll, uh, we'll try our best. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll just get over here and see what we can do here. Let's go. Oh, yeah, that's good. That's good. I mean, yeah, but I only got five. I only got five PP on that, on that move. Oh, okay. And if he's got ground type Pokemon, yeah. Don fans a ground type, so yeah, I shouldn't have been my fire extra. guy. <laughs> I know that's what I said. <laughs> so I what are we doing? We're uh, <laughs> yeah. If you uh, what is it? If you prepare to, if you don't prepare if you to prepare. fail, yeah, yeah. Oh, if you fail to prepare, prepare to fail. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh no, he did one shot at me. Okay, we're done, man. Done, but done, done, man. We're gonna done, go back into this one and just like this. He's done, done, man, done, man. I. Can we like redo it or do we have to quit? Uh, we can try running, but we'll likely just uh. Yeah. The opposing team is too nervous. Okay, what? Let's go. Energy has began to gather around Dante. So this sucks. So halfway through Terra Wave, they get this heal. Oh. And so like, you can't. So it. Yeah. Yeah, let's see if we can run. It's no good. You, you're running, you can't run away from such a strong opponent. Oh. Yeah. Well, I've, I've never been able to effectively run away from. Uh, uh, all right. Well, uh, let's kick his ass then. Let's do it. Yeah. Let's go. At least he just one shot at me. <laughs> I roll out as such a. Oh. And they just. I think when you start it, you like, can't stop it. You just have to keep rolling yeah. out. Yeah. Exactly. Okay, well, gotta keep rolling now. Why? I do kind of like how you guys got a Pandora. I feel like he, he is nice. like a party clown. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> He's just a clown. Yeah. <laughs> good time. Yeah. I like it. How's work, man? Uh, yes, yeah, good. Busy. Ooh. Busy, busy. Uh, I got called into work this weekend. Well, just today. Ooh. Um, okay. but you know what? Uh, a little extra spending money. That's okay. There you go. Around the holiday. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Works out. Yep. Re Works out. Yeah. Reimburse for all my Christmas gifts. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's good. And now you're, um, are you still doing like the, what, the new, the newspaper stuff and then going to Ethiopia soon? Yeah. So my, I've got two more weeks at the Community Association. Mm -hmm. And then I leave for Ethiopia on January 11th. Wow. Which is nuts, right? Yeah. And, like, how long are you gone for? Six fucking months. Ooh, baby. Right? That's exciting. Right? Wow. It's going to be good. Yeah. It's going to be, wow. Uh, today, I uh, finally got off my ass and uh, reached out to somebody that i like want to do an internship for mm. and they got back to me right away and they were it seems very positive which is why i didn't reach out sooner because i had a feeling that i would be able to find someone who would take me on as a i'm basically gonna gonna go work as an intern okay um, so either for this company or another company um if they if can't find a, a role for me that's a good fit mm, wow. and and so the, the plan is like six months of like living with the family learning the language and then I want to do an, un un an unpaid internship as a method of, like, developing an understanding of what's happening in the business culture there. And just kind of, I don't know, like, seeing if there's a fit. Because I've been talking about this for so long that um, I feel like it's high time I either say, yes, I'm doing this full time, or nah, I'm just going <laughs> to, I'm, like, just going to really commit to living in Alberta and loving my life there. That's cool, and man. Yeah, yeah, go yeah, hard. And, uh, no, like, right? 
right? While you're young and you got some flexibility, like go go enjoy that stuff. That'd be so cool. Exactly, exactly. Uh, kind of figure out figure out that decision early on rather than uh, like regretting ever uh -huh. Oh, yeah. okay, this is, this is it. Gardevoir's doing the job. Wow. Nice. Wow. My, my boy is back in. After getting hey, hit. Hit. Hey, my Run. queen. The queen. All hail the queen. Yep. Yeah, but I guess I'll leave him like 32 days. Countdown has begun. <laughs> Absolutely. And now Absolutely. this internship, is it like, uh, are you doing like autoclave stuff again or is it like something totally different? This should be totally different. This is actually going to be like in the like business communication. Wow. Uh, yeah. So, uh, avoid from jumping all over the place. He's trying to find himself. He's trying to find himself. <laughs> I dig it. I dig it. All right. Uh, this is the day. It's time, it's time to do it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just want to know, like, what what business? What business? <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. So, so the company that I reached out to, they uh, do marketing for some of like the major brands in Ethiopia, like big coffee companies, oh, Ethiopian Airlines. Yeah. Okay. Um, right. Right. And so they do. Okay. Okay. So because both of us died, we lost a bunch of time. Like, you uh, sure. get industrialized. I wonder if I. Crash like failure. I think I crash like No, no, come on. Come on. You do it, we can do it. Let's go. Okay. I'm glad hopefully we can yeah. get this done. Right? Let's go. One extra country moon blast. Come on, guy, Dubois. If this doesn't work, we're gonna go up to three star race next. Okay. Oh, come on, buddy. If it avoids this attack, I will. Yes! Yeah, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? Sick. Nice job. Thank you, thank you. Uh, you can catch this one. They're guaranteed catching. Right. Yeah. Kind of like uh, I guess Sun and Moon had. No, no. Sorry. <laughs> Sword and Shield had the Dynamax battle. Oh, that's it, okay. It's like the same thing, know. but instead of being like bedazzled, they turned into like giant like Godzilla-sized creatures. And then you like threw a giant Pokeball to like catch it. It was kind of fun. Oh, that's, that's awesome. But so. what I'm like, already this is like, what, the second Terrasta whatever the hell we just did. And yeah. uh, they're so much faster, and I already love it because the the Gigantamax, Dynamax shit in uh, yeah. Sword and Shield, like it took so long that I just I gave up. I was like, I'm not doing this oh, anymore. Oh, for real? Oh. <laughs> yeah, like there was no timer, no nothing, and like all that you had to wait for every single animation. It took forever because like if if I would have sat through it with the new DLC, you could get like a bunch of legendary Pokemon, but I was just like, nah, I don't have time for this. So this is great. Yeah, yeah. I'm digging this. Sick. Yeah, I'm, this is it's it's um it's fun that this is also the format by which you have multiplayer functionality. Mm -hmm. I think you you can just kind of play in the same world. And now that our world, I mean, like if you had Scarlet, because our worlds are connected, you could catch the Pokemon that is specific to Scarlet, and I could catch this Pokemon that is specific to like yeah the exclusives. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that like that is the only other perk besides. Uh, doing raids together. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nice, dude. Well, I'm gonna. Oh yeah. Add him to my party, I guess. I want to see what level he is. Do wants. it. And uh, do you see what rewards you got? I got a lot of candy. Heck yeah, that's what you want, my friend. Yeah. So let's. I got like three medium candies and one large candy. So let's get. Oh, I just passed one of your crystals. Oh, sweet. What a. I have my own crystal. I guess so, yeah. Cause you I got your own crystal. Yeah, yeah, you got your own terrestrial ter ter So we're... Is, I, it, uh, is it these I red just... things? Is, mm, maybe? There's a yellow one. Does, does it look like the red one? It looks like a little it, gem there, thingy. That, that yellow one that's right next to you is probably mine. Because I on my map, I can see an electric type crystal that's really close to where you are. Okay, well, let me go see this one over here. 
Oh, yeah, okay, because you're the resident Pokemon expert here. Um, how do, <laughs> how do how, I know? How this yeah, how the tables have turned. How do yeah. I make the motorcycle lizard go faster? You have to be one of the types. Oh, okay. All right. So, um, someone just pointed this up to me yesterday, which is really fun. Again, not the resident Pokemon expert. I've just been playing more than you have. <laughs> this is how. Um, but one of the guys I was uh, doing raids with yesterday mentioned that um, beating the Titans is the same thing as getting HMs in the previous games. Oh, oh, okay. It's uh, using like it's like surf and fly and all the HMs that like <laughs> us old OG Pokemon trainers used to use to get around that yeah. uh, beating the, the Titans that you go. Okay, good to know, because, like, yeah, like, the old games, you would have, uh, what, <laughs> we used to call him, like, an HM slave, because you would just have, yes. like, one, like, shitty, like, Geodude that could know, like, Absolutely. rock smash and strength <laughs> and, like, all the things, yeah. yeah, okay. Absolutely. Cool. Uh, so, you don't need rock smash in this game, but you will, like, you get a speed increase after the first Titan, you get, uh, you don't get fly, but you get, like, a gliding function, because you can already fly, basically, with, um, with the, the map, right? You right. Just, oh, yeah, you pick the place, and the, you take a taxi or something, right? Totally, yeah. yeah. And then, uh, oh, there's a dragon head, uh, up there, right? Ooh. Up ahead. Ooh. I'll, I'll go see what that one looks like. Um... But the best one I've found so far is that uh, after you beat all of them, you get the ability to climb up walls, which is excellent. It's like Zelda Breath of the Wild here. Ooh, yeah. That's Except a... the, the graphics are not as nice, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got, a, I got a cricket tune, a three star cricket tune. All right, we can Dragon kick, type. We can kick his ass. Dragon type? Oh, because he terrestrializes. Dra yeah, he yeah, he terrestrializes the dragon. I'll get, I'll get myself an ice type here. I, I accidentally kicked a, a rookie rookie D, so I gotta, gotta get out. Ooh, just, nice. just punch it. Out. Just rookie D move. <laughs> <laughs> but don't. <laughs> okay, we're in. Oh, this is the guy that goes. Uh, is, is that what he does? Yeah, that's his like cry. I think. Is that? It, it sounds like um. The the squid character from Futurama. Oh, Zoid you know Zoidberg. <laughs> Zoidberg, yeah. Nice. Yes. Yeah, exactly. That's exactly the sound you just made. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Li here, li listen in when he shows up. I don't know if they're they get distorted when they're terrestrialized, but maybe. Okay, so I um, so I gotta I gotta ask you about like what you're doing for your your like stream slash recording setup because I have been trying to use. OBS, mm -hmm. and I am a noob, and I can't figure out how to hear my game through my OBS system. So I have no audio currently. Like, which is fine because I'm talking to you, and I don't need to be distracted by the game Pokemon. But it definitely does take away from the whole. Thing. Yeah, this is a jam, dude. The guitar. I know. Holy crap. It's, 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 a, it's a really good soundtrack, and I cannot hear it at all. Jeez. Okay, well. So what are you, okay, so are you using pure OBS or like Streamlabs OBS? I'm using pure OBS. Okay. So uh, bad. Whoa, you just wrecked that kid. Absolutely. Wow. So when I very like first started, I tried using regular OBS and I, I couldn't figure it out. It was like too tricky for me. So I do Streamlabs OBS, which I, I don't really know what the true difference between it is, but I just find it's more user friendly. Right, I, think, I think that's what they're paying for. Do you pay for Streamlabs? No, 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 no. I got the free. Like, you can... I think you can pay for, like, extra stuff, but I'm, I don't... Um, something about maybe, like, being able to stream on, like, multiple platforms at the same time. Oh, uh, yeah. Pay for that. But, yeah, um, so you Streamlabs, and uh, what? what's your capture card? Like, what do you use? I got a really shitty little $20 capture card from Amazon. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's like a, it's, it's an HDMI video capture card. I think that if I was planning to stream 
more consistently slash professionally, I would definitely go for like something like a, like a hundred dollar, two hundred dollar Elgato thing. Mm-hmm. Um, but at the moment, uh, I'd be I'd be moving to a country for six months <laughs> that doesn't have really great consistent access to internet. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought I would just test drive this little twenty dollar capture card and see what the process looks like. Now that's cool. Um, yeah, I don't know what like your OBS will look like, but uh, when you have like your mixer with all your different settings, like the, or your different, I don't know, your inputs. Uh, like, yeah. I, I, so I have like desktop audio for one. I've got the microphone, which is a um, a Blue Yeti. Um, nice. And then I have is like the same a, one you had like in high school. Uh, actually that one broke, believe it or not. Oh, it just, God. uh, like when I plugged it in, it just, it was like, Nee-e-e-e. like it just had this really whiny pitch thing. I don't know what happened. So, but now they're, sweet. they're actually like pretty reasonably priced. So I just bought another one oh, on sweet. Amazon and this one is in, uh, it's in a color matte black. So that's pretty cool. Very fancy. Yeah. And, uh, I just bought like a cheap, uh, what do you call it? A, a microphone arm on like Amazon. So. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Got that set up, uh, but yeah. So, yeah. Y- like, in theory, you should have like a third output line, whatever, for your capture device. You might have to like insert that in yourself. So, like, when you have your sources of uh, like footage, like I have like one source is the webcam, and then the other source is the Elgato. Um, you might have to like add that in manually, maybe. I don't that- know. That makes sense. Uh, so, because currently I've got the the video capture card in as one source, mm. and it is not registered. It, like it does not register as actual audio. It's just video. So I added in a separate source as my audio output or audio input capture, and that is actually registering music. So I think that that is picking up the audio from the game. Yep. However, I'm not able to move that over to like the output on my like on my computer itself oh so like like, I'm, like if i understand sorry. right then when when you play back your recording like like there's the music but when you're actually doing it you don't hear it is that it yes exactly. oh yeah so there there's probably a way on the the output for the audio you can probably right click it and say like monitor and then you can say like monitor like like i guess if the monitor is on then you hear the music coming back at you kind of right. thing so there's probably oh, a setting you know, that's, for that. that's probably the that's probably the piece that i'm missing because i have audio input audio output um like their audio monitoring because monitor like monitor is like active however i bet i just haven't turned on the monitor <laughs> could be i bet uh, that's probably that's probably what i'm missing <laughs> Gotta find that one out. Yeah, yeah, man. It's good. I've been like, okay, a monitoring device. Oh, let's we'll see if that works. Mm-hmm. Let me see what mine looks like. Uh, I've got to. Yeah, so like mine I have it set, like there's monitor off, monitor only, mute the output, and then there's monitor and output. By having See, this is, this is why the Elgato comes in clutch, because that, like having all of that stuff just a little bit easier to access, OBS is very <laughs> I think uh, I bet you OBS is like really good if if you're like like really deep into that, you know? Yeah. You know, like you know all the funky settings and stuff, but I'm just like dumb it down for me, please. How do I do yeah. that? <laughs> Absolutely. Now, uh, my friend, are we still connected? I got a little message error message that says that. Oh, did I get my kicked out? Interrupted. Oh, well, let's find out. Oh no, it says you're still here. I had Never mind. I'm trying to find uh one of my crystals oh nice i got a raid for us if you want well yes please let's do it 
Do you want to go for a salamance? Four star salamance? Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, just oh, just before I accept it, let's let's pump up my uh, my boy with all these okay, let's wonderful things. Oh, it's, it's a water type, so it's, it's terrestrializing water. Um, <laughs> the strategy here, though, is that salamance probably can't learn a, water, a lot of water moves. So you gotta make sure he's like, your Pokemon's gonna be okay. <laughs> Res resisting dragon type moves. Well, well. Oh, and so you know what? So here, I'm gonna. I've got. Uh, I've got the perfect Pokemon for this. Okay. <laughs> Good. I've got a. Uh, yeah, that's what we're doing. I've got a level 70 Appleton. That I'm gonna oh, use. sick, dude. He's yeah, in this game. Yeah, he's that's good. He is. Yeah. Yeah, it's good. I um. He's really hard to find as a spawn, like little, like a little, uh, yeah, little apple boy. Oh, yeah, little applin guy. Yeah. Um, but my my roomie found him as a raid, and so we picked him up, nice. and I I've been using him ever since. It's been really fun. Uh, which is actually maybe we should go and do some one star raids for you, and then uh, we can pick up some cool Pokemon that you wouldn't get otherwise. Sounds good. Let's do it. No, let's, let's fill the Pokedex, man. Yeah. Oh, I went too far. Now Arvin's talking to me on the phone here. Oh. From what I gather, the stony yep. cliff titan likes to lurk somewhere in this rocky area. I couldn't find a trace of it. If you want, you could you could go find the, the stony cliff titan and go beat it. Nah. And then, uh, all right, all right, nah, all right. dude. Let's let's do. <laughs> you're here, man. I can play that anytime. I can only Appreciate play with Gideon sometimes, you know. Accurate. I mean, we got we got 30 days, and we can play as much Pokemon as we can. Squeeze into yeah. you in a month. Hell yeah. See if I yeah, I'll, I'll level up my boys, then we'll be doing the five stars like it's nothing. Absolutely, absolutely. If, uh, hey. if memory serves me right, I think that Salamance can learn Surf. I'm not saying this one has it. Oh. I'm just saying okay. he might be able to. Don't quote me on that it. That would be hilarious. And while I say don't quote me on it, I'm going to Google it. Um, All right. I like Salamat it. Surf. Pokemon expert Ethan Swanson in the house. <laughs> uh, Feel some people say yes. Yes, you can. Oh, what a terrible. Yeah, that's really good. Appleton, Griffin, Ah, Fairy will be good against Dragon. I think. Yes, yes it is. Yes it is. Yes, that's a sword and no, a sun and moon thing at fairy types. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yep. Yep. All right. We're all intimidated. I, I get it. Yep. I get what? Do we be super effective? Why? <laughs> but this is oh, is it just a dragon type move and I'm dragon type? Oh, yeah, I would have thought it was flying, but maybe not. Or maybe it is a flying type moving because of grass type that's all flying. Oh, yeah, that'll do it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's doing about the same amount of damage as I am, though, so. It's a two way street. It is. Because <laughs> I thought. Oh, uh, what is Salamance the exclusive for Violet, but then like Dragonite's supposed to be exclusive for Scarlet? But we clearly saw like a Dragonair raid, so maybe that's how you get the exclusive too. I don't. Uh, no, it's um, not. It's, it's Tyranitar, not Dragon. Oh! Tyranitar is the one that's yeah, Tyranitar is exclusive to Scarlet. Yep, you got it. My bad. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I know this because yesterday I was in Tyranitar. Great. Heck yeah. Heck to the yeah. <laughs> right, let's go, let's go. Every ball don't fail me now. Oh wait, I should... Wait, I got that. I got that fire. Uh, uh, new meta. Oh my god. Right? I know. I know. And uh, they'll probably drop it. We'll all, like, <laughs> be totally useless. That's how it goes, yeah, they did, uh, what, Mega Evolutions, now that's gone, then they did, the, uh, the Z moves, and now that's gone, then they did Dynamax, and that's gone, so, another one. Another one. I'm gonna go here. Oh, we're so close. We're so close.
broken its stance. Okay, so you gotta, Ooh. you still gotta like knock it out all the way. Yeah, exactly. But, but now our time is to go back and do the full, full damage. Come on, Tosh. Come on. Yes. <laughs> nice job. I like that's pretty dope. You get a guaranteed catch on a Salamance. Right? Like, it's sick. Yeah. Also, the animation for the catching and characterization, like, it's so extra. <laughs> it feels like a magical thing. <laughs> it really does. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh. Like, like the Pokemon is just telling me. It's both. It, it can be both. Damn straight. Ba -ba -da -da. Good stuff. Ooh, did you get any large experience candy? I sure did. Heck yeah, I got one, two. I got wait, I that's six. I got six? six large. I got one large. Five, no, five large. Yeah, I got five. Whoa. No, no, I got I got eight, seven. I got seven large. I can do math. I wow. swear I can do math. Nice job. That's sick. Thank you, for, thank you very much. <laughs> That's good. If you got a, so like those large experience candies will give you like 10,000 XP. Yeah, let's just do it. Yeah, you're gonna level up so fast. Mm -hmm. That's good. And you're a fire guy, so uh, you'll take down the. You will take down the. <laughs> the type grass gym, no types? Oh, is that the. Yeah, the grass type gym. The grass type gym I thought was like the easiest. Like, it was the one that I beat first, oh, yeah. and it was not, not a big problem at all. Okay, sweet. Well, let me, let me do this. I got seven, I got seven larges, eight mediums, three smalls, and one extra small. Let's, let's load this boy up until he let's go. refuses to obey me. <laughs> okay, we've got flamethrower. Well, actually, because, because you've had him since, like, since you the start of the game, he will still obey you even if you level up. <gasps> you just can't, you can't catch Pokemon that are higher than that level and expect them to obey you. Mm, okay, okay. Cool. Okay. You can just tell me Pokemon Professor Yeah. The <laughs> check, check this out. Ooh, four-star Taurus? Dark type? Oh, yeah, he's, uh, yeah, he's a different color this time. He is a different color in Paldea. That's cool. Yeah. Let's do it, yeah. Yeah. All right, let's go. Okay. Uh, dark type is gonna be weak to. S <laughs> oh wait, right. Monchi is evolving. I kind of forgot oh, yes. that was gonna happen. Th that will happen absolutely. Let's go. Oh. Whoa, he's even a bigger clown. Oh, is it Skeleturge now? Yes, Skeleturge. Yeah. Skeleturge. Heck and With Torch Song. Yeah. Okay, so he's the. Wait, what, what what level are you now? That. Uh, like. I'll I'll check in a sec, like 33, 36 or something. Heck, heck yeah. Okay, so and you haven't even beat a single gym. No, <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> okay, so skeleter 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 uh, fire and ghost. It's, <laughs> it's gentle singing soothes the sounds of all that hear it. It burns its enemies to a crisp with flames over five thousand four hundred degrees Fahrenheit. <laughs> Toasty. And he's 700 pounds. Wow. Do not mess with him. I would not want to walk uh, down an alley at night and come across a skeleton. <laughs> that sounds terrible. Unless it's karaoke night. Then Unless it's karaoke night. That might be he's, good. Uh, he's, he's passed out outside of the bar. <laughs> that might be fun. <laughs> All right. Should I, should I invite you to this raid? Uh, yes, please. Let us go. Let us go. I'm going to change the Pokemon. Okay, Dark is weak to fight. I think fighting? Fighting beats Dark? Oh man, I'm embarrassed to say I don't remember a lot of that. Yeah, I, I can like, I can get the ones that make elemental sense, right? I'm like, yes, fire beats grass. This makes sense. <laughs> but then when it's like very dark psychic ghost, I can never, Bug is in there for some reason. I think and... Bug Bug gets beats psychic because like, you know, bugs are like inherently like scary, right? Like they freak people out. Okay. <laughs> that, I think, I think is that's that the that argument? Works. Yeah, but now I can't remember oh. if dark beats fighting or fighting beats dark because I, is it the fighting that like, like punches through the fighting. dark because they're brave kind fighting. of thing? I think it's two types good against dark. But okay. Bug is all 
You have to get against dark. Against dark. Okay, that I don't get. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense to me. And then bug is two times effective against grass. That makes sense. Yeah. Two times effective against psychic doesn't make sense to me. Bugs are scary, man. It's, they freak Bugs you are out. scary. You, you, That's see, true. you see that like a true. spider in your house, and I mean, you probably don't go ah, but I might. Ah. I I would I might I might go ah. <laughs> I probably would go ah. <laughs> That's right. I'd also just just I'd also just buck up and get the job done. Yeah, you probably just get a boot or something and just slam yeah, the wall. Well, Beth, Beth has this rule that uh, we can only have seven spiders in a place that we live in, and then we have to leave. And so I just I get rid of as many spiders as I can without letting her know. Therefore, we don't. <laughs> oh, it's like a it's a it's a cumulative amount. Like regardless if they it were is. killed or sent outside mm -hmm. or. Yes. Exactly. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Dark side Taurus. Now. Yeah, okay, shoot. Oh, we got a bunch of normal moves. Maybe some gout type moves. Whoa, well, nice tail you got there, crack guy. Thank is you he much. dancing? He is dancing. Our, our little flamboyant duck. <laughs> wow, and I'm the clown and you're the jester then. And absolutely, absolutely. We, uh, they, they really decided to go, like, full. Eastern, Western European, like, yeah. uh, like uh, opulent. <laughs> opulent. That's uh, opulent. That's yeah. a word. Yeah. That's the word that we're gonna use. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like it. You're fast. Are you using torch bomb also already? Yeah. Are you doing it? Yeah. Excellent. Excellent work. Is he fighting type Ooh. too then? Your duck? Yes, it's fighting water. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Grasslight, your Pokemon. Let's go. Low key though, I, I do think it's kind of lame that sometimes your Terrastalize type is still like your regular type. I don't know. Mm, like, yeah. like you just get an extra like special attack or something. Like I don't know what the benefit is. Yeah, you do get that. It will or just be some stats. So, for example, my. Ah, uh, oh, shoot! I just came in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I right, hold down the fort. So, I'm, I'm, I'm on it, bro. I got it. Let's go, let's go. I'm pumped full of candy. I'm ready to kick ass. Heck yeah. Now I'm gonna keep using my fighting type moves because it's doing the most damage, but then I I will collapse a lot because my fighting type move is not doing a whole bunch of damage. I'm not even making a dent into this guy. So I am making a dent in him, but I'm using an attack that lowers yeah. my special defense and regular defense. Oh. And therefore, his attacks are getting much more effective against me. Yeah, it is not helping. Okay. Uh, Alright, I'm going to try to take him out with this last one. Fingers crossed. Yes! Hey, hey nice. They're so aggressive in the wild that they just rush they you. Like, they, yeah, they they will charge. Wow. I know. They, I'm, I don't. I, I haven't played a whole lot of Pokemon games, but it feels like on this one they really leaned into words. Depending what we're insane, and so we're gonna use a bunch of like weird <laughs> Spanish. Stereotypes that you didn't know that you knew, but as soon as you talk about them, you definitely. I like, I like the raging bull yeah. stereotypes. Yeah, what do or they like, call it? The mar the, it's not the march of the bull, but like, yeah, like they just let them loose, right? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Wow. And and like small live, I know like I think olive oil and think Italy, but also this region definitely gets the like the olive oil like piece. Why not? I think it's very funny how yeah, and then. Um, Skeletor is wearing a sombrero. 
as well. Like, I think it's very silly how they've leaned into <laughs> all these pieces of Spanish culture that I'm not sure are, or, like, are not Spanish culture. <laughs> sure. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I get you. And then, like... Oh, okay. Yeah, go ahead. No, you go first. Oh, uh... I was just gonna say, like, pe people like always bash like the new Pokemon, like, oh, I don't like the designs; they don't look as cool. It's like Voltorb was literally just a ball with eyes, man. Like, uh huh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and like, I like that too, but like, don't say that that's more creative, okay? Like, right? Yeah. I really like how they've taken some Pokemon in this game and they've just copied previous designs, but then said that they're different. Like, have you have you caught a Wiglet yet? Oh. <laughs> well, yeah, but no, I, I haven't <laughs> caught it yet, but I, I know what that is, yeah. They're just like, it's not Diglett, it's water type. But I'm like, you guys 100% just copied Diglett. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try to fool me. Like, you, la you lazy. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to give Terra the nickname? No, I will not give Terra the nickname. Um, I named but... him Olay, but spelled really oh. dumb. <laughs> I don't know how you actually spell Ole, so... Ole, 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 Ole. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, that's the first horse I've caught. Nice. Oh, well, there you go. Cool. Let's get... Ooh, I'm next to one of your crystals now. Oh, sure. This is Swan Dizzle's crystal. Oh, which, uh... Well, I don't see if this one's mine or yours. I don't even know. This is... I'm to find you. Oh, it's a it's a one star Makuhita. Ooh, is that one we want to do? I don't know. I mean, do you want a Makuhita? Sure, let's get a Makuhita. Why not? Let's go. Swan Dizzle's invited you to join a terror raid. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, is it bug time? Hilarious. Oh, really? I didn't even notice. Wow. Yeah. That's one thing that you like start getting used to once you start playing this for is like all the different symbols for the different types. Mm -hmm. I still struggle a little bit to get the difference between ice type and steel type, but I'm getting there. Sweet. I guess yeah. What a little little kind of beetle looking antenna thingy. Is that what we're taking away from the symbol? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Mm. Because I think, oh, I might be grossly wrong on this, but like even with Pokemon cards now, like some people say, like it's not, it's not like grass energy, it's like leaf energy. But maybe that's just like a oh, cool thing. thing. I don't know if that's like really cool. I think it might be cool. Yeah. Yo, dude, I, I've even started playing. Did you play a Pokemon trading card game? I, <laughs> not really. I, uh, no. I like. I like, like, I love Lugia as a legendary, so I bought a couple uh, yeah, packs yeah. of uh, Silver Tempest just for funsies. Nice. I, I got a holographic Dragonite. Oh, one cool. oh did you all. just one-shot him? Fuck yeah. Oh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's cool. It's over. I, I always thought he kind of looked like a, like a used diaper man. You know? Oh! Like yeah. he's just a bag of shit. <laughs> I don't know. I uh, I, that, I was like, yeah, he kind of does look like a steam dumpling, like like a bow. Kind of <laughs> and here I'm thinking a different kind of dump. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm, like, I'm like, I don't, nope, not that kind of dumpling. Oh, what? oh no. <laughs> Oops. Oof. Oof. Oh, oh. We're, we're shutting down this kitchen. We're not going. We're not starting a restaurant. Nope, nope. Shut it down now. Okay, what's with these ingredients though? I got oh, Makuhita right. sweat. Why would I want that? <laughs> have you not been, have, you, have you gone to the Pokemon Center and like uh, you can make TMs or something, right? You can make TMs, yeah. Okay. So uh, Makuhita sweat is probably a key ingredient that a lot of fighting type moves. <laughs> <laughs> now, okay, so the HMs are gone. I get that. Now there's TMs, and TMs are always like mm -hmm. a one-time use. But, yep. but in, if I remember right, in Sword and Shield, they had, like, TR, and it was, like, a TM that you could just reuse indefinitely. Oh, neat. So are there reusable ones in this, or it's just one nah, and done? No, I think they got rid of those. Oh, that's uh, lame. These are, these are one and done as well. Okay. Um, yeah, these... You just have to keep, like, you have to go catch the Pokemon that make up the ingredients of the TM that you want. Right. Yeah. 
And once you catch enough of those Pokemon, then you can basically create any TM. Uh, what sucks is that, like, you often have to find the TMs in the wild, and then it will register at the... Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. at the focus Center? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it, it makes it difficult to know whether or not you're actually using it optimal moves for your Pokemon. I mean, in my case, I know I am never using the optimal moves because it's just like, <laughs> I, I figured out like stab typing and I'm like, all right, you're a fire type. Let's learn like three fire moves. That's fine. Nice. Whatever. I like it. I like it. <laughs> Are we going competitive? No. No. <laughs> um, I find it like I, it, it is uh, shocking to me how far the world of Pokemon has advanced and like where the fandom is compared to when like I was playing as an eight-year-old. Mm -hmm. I'm sure there are people who were very aggressively into it back then as well, but with the onset of the internet and like streaming and people playing not only for enjoyment, but also for clout, <laughs> it, is, uh, it is a scary world out here for the like, returning Pokemon players. <laughs> you get a lot to learn, right? Yeah. I do, I do, yeah, yeah, yeah. So stab typing, that's new to me. That, that, uh, it's like useful information to have. Uh, what else? Oh, um, determining whether or not specific types of Pokemon are specially, like, are special attackers oh, or physical attackers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you familiar with, like, this, like, this approach? Like, I, I know what it is, but if you were to tell me, like, oh, like, what is Gengar? Like, I'd be like, I don't know. But I, I, yeah, I, I, I get yeah. it, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think, I don't think most people, I'm sure there are some people that know <laughs> this, but most people don't know off the bat if, like, for example, like, High roar is a special attacker or a physical attacker, but when you catch one, you can look at its stats, and then you can figure out whether or not it's better at special attack moves or physical attack moves. Mm -hmm. So I was taught my high roar a bunch of special fire type attacks because I know it's going to deal more damage because you've got a better special attack stat. Oh, that's cool. okay. right? Right, right, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Anyways, my my roommate has been running me through all of this. Oh, yeah, you're you're well me through. Thank you. Yes, we are, we are trying. Uh, dark type, therefore, we're gonna go with, uh... Oh, I should get in on that who, one. Who is it? It's a Chansey. Okay, yeah, I'll join on that. And it's, it's a three-star, so we'll, we'll back with that. I'm just trying to catch this little, uh... He looks like a little rock mushroom. Is it oh, yeah. a knackly? Uh, it's funny, right? I should get that. What? What is? What am I missing? And <laughs> NACL, the salt, oh. the little rock salt Pokemon. Wow. <laughs> it's a chemistry Genius. joke. Genius. Right? Wow. And I should know that as the pharmacist. Wow. As okay. the pharmacist, you should know this. Love I that. should be able to count, and you should know basic <laughs> elemental structures. Yes. We give sodium chloride to people all the time. <laughs> I'm gonna name you. I'm gonna name you Science. I like it. I try to make an effort of Science every. Rules. Yeah, bill, 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 bill. So I try to make an effort of every new Pokemon that I have not caught before and gets a nickname. I don't care how stupid it is, like you get a nickname. Uh, I like it. Okay, so let's join your thingy. Um, let's see, Terra Raid. There are raids. Do, 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 do. All right, Chansey, three star. Is that dark? Yes. Okay, sweet. Let's go. Let's just go. <laughs> oh, help has arrived. Now you got a full party to raid with. Dude, how did that happen? Wow. All right. Well, hey, man. <laughs> Voice acting. Mm. Mm. Tell me. You, I, you, you once told me we were on a hike uh, about a year ago that voice, act, voice acting was the, was, the, was the dream. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, it's gone nowhere, but I'm enjoying uh, this YouTube thing. Where the so. Heck yeah. It's, it's my favorite thing in the world. Okay, so I, uh, I've, been, I've been streaming for like four months. Five, four months in? No? Wow. Um, not, not Pokemon, but uh, Chaotic. On Tuesdays, every, uh, for an hour, every evening. 
I have been, uh, yeah, 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 I, uh, I found a bunch of which is like magic, and so I uh, bought them for an absurd amount of money, and they do engineering up. And then I, uh, oh, I'm doing a ghost type move. No, <laughs> terrible. I was uh, opening their carts, and it's great. Uh, therefore. I've been doing that live for four months, it's been really fun, and I've discovered this, like, aspect of live streaming that really taps into my desire to talk all the time, my, my like, for connecting with people, it's really fun, and it's got me thinking about, like, oh, maybe I should, like, consider, like, live streaming like maybe this is one of those aspects of which like, I can take advantage of some of these natural skills and abilities and go do cool things. Um, but that's beside the point. Like, I just think it's really fun. Um, I uh, also want to try acting. Yeah, man. And it's been sweet. I have been on, uh, I've been an extra on several TV shows. Really? And it's been, yeah, it's been dope. It's been really good. Oh, so like that's all up in Calgary then. Absolutely, yeah. Am I, am so I going to see you in The Last of Us? No, unfortunately, <laughs> I decided to start uh, being an extra after The Last of Us is all done filming. Okay, so like, Here's like what shows, sadness, though? But, what shows? Um, uh, Dan Arden has a show, or had a show, it's just come to an end, but I was in the season finale uh, Christmas special. Wow. Um, I have... I have not seen it yet. It just aired yesterday, and I'm gonna go watch it and see if my face actually made it in. That's so cool. Which would be super cool, right? Wow, okay, cool. Uh, thanks, man. I uh, was an extra on a show called Ride, which is being filmed for the Hallmark Channel, which is awesome. So uh, I'm gonna be in a Hallmark TV show, which is hilarious. <laughs> And then uh, I've been an extra on a couple other shows. Um, there's a company here in Calgary that does a bunch of... Uh, hold on, I'm just going to... I name my Chancy Chance, and awesome. we're going to send to the doctors. Um, there's a company in Calgary that does a bunch of like recreation filming for crime documentaries that get aired on American TV. Okay. So I'm in a show called The Floor of Bama Murder. <laughs> wow. That Are you the murderer I, uh, or like was, the victim? I was, um, I was in the first, on the first day of shooting, I, I was a home intruder that ended up <laughs> being a part of a gang of guys that all, like one yeah. of the other guys who was a home intruder, like got to be the murderer. And then on the second day of shooting, it was a totally different story. I was a guy who is borrowing money from a brand new lotto winner. Like my friend had won some lottery money and I was taking advantage of him, even though we all knew it was wrong. Anyway, so what so it's like it's these like fuzzy background shots that are on camera. You can't see anybody's face really clearly, but you're able to kind of get a feel for what's happening and then the witnesses are doing a voiceover at the same time so the, the witnesses are real but then all that footage is fake and it's recreated and some of it gets filmed it, it gets filmed all over the world uh oh. including here in uh the beautiful calgary alberta wow. right isn't that crazy that's so cool now how did yeah, you, been... you just email people like how'd you get into it you know this is the thing this is the thing i got into it because um i was talking to folks telling them like, hey, I really want to, I want to work on like film and TV. I want to try this out. I'm exploring all these things. And a friend of mine found someone, my, my friend of mine said, oh, I know someone who does this and she has an agent. Uh, so you can <laughs> email her agent. And she said that it'd be fine. So like I got the email address for this woman named Wendy and she runs a talent agency and you should send an email to her because she's sometimes has voice acting jobs and you have to audition for some of this stuff but uh got, that's like this the first step is like getting on this email list and actually like going and doing stuff you just gotta get in there and then and now now i'm in this like website 
like center where every single week, every other day, I get these emails from Wendy saying like, hey, are you available on this date to be an extra on this thing? Hey, are you available for <laughs> this TV commercial? Uh, do you want to audition for this thing? They recently had a, uh, an, like an international call for a, uh, a movie that was filming in Jamaica. And so I like, they, I, I think I just like, I'm on her list as like African-American man. <laughs> and thus I get like, she's like, oh yeah, like you might fit this. Do you want to apply for it? And I'm like, yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> we need diversity. Hello, Gideon. We need, <laughs> ab absolutely. Absolutely. I, uh, I had a good laugh when uh, I got cast as Home Invader, and I'm like, mm, I'm not sure. <laughs> but thankfully, I wasn't the only black person on set. There were also white Home Invaders. So oh, you know right. what? That's uh, 2022. <laughs> <laughs> About damn time. There's our equality. <laughs> there it is. Anyone can be a Home Invader. Wow, man. That's awesome. Thanks, dude. So cool. It's been, it's been really fun. And... Um, I, I've been like getting kind of nervous heading into like this transition into Ethiopia. I'm like, did I make the most of the last six months of like not working as an engineer and like trying all these new things and, and doing cool shit? Uh, I think it did. I think I think it went pretty darn well. Um, I also slept a lot and was a total degenerate and did not really have any sort of proper discipline around like uh, like getting a like. A, decent sleep schedule put together or all these sort of things but like i i uh i don't know i feel like that's uh that's the like type a overachiever in me that's like you should have done more and i'm like i, I think it's plenty actually it's pro i'm probably fine i'm probably I, doing better i think if, if anything that probably just prepared you for all the jet lag you're gonna have anyway like why yeah. why focus on a good Truly. sleep schedule and you're gonna fly across the country anyway I like it. My, my, uh, secretly I'm like, mm, you know what, when I don't have, like, as decent access to internet or it's, like, way more expensive in Ethiopia, uh, I won't be, like, up until 2 a.m. every night streaming anime or watching TV or, uh, doing anything else that, like, requires me to stay up way past my night. So, right, so uh, I'm just going to change the environment to build a new habit. <laughs> and that, that will be helpful for us all. For a small amount of time, just wait, and then yeah. then you'll be partying until 2 a.m. over in Ethiopia. It's great. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, I also changing the environment. I'll be living with my grandma, and <laughs> I will have to I will have to keep all partying under wraps uh, as uh, to yes. not feel deep shame. Right, right. right. <laughs> uh, definitely not in the basement. If there any not basement. in the basement of grandma's house. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna see if my so my my mom's family owns a apartment building and. My plan is to um, see if there's an open room, and then if possible, like a, like an actual open unit, and I might just ask to pay rent for six months and like have my own room and, and lock the key in, or my, my own unit and lock the key and that, that whole standing in. Yep. But it's more likely that I'll probably be living in a room in like my uncle's house or my aunt's. Mm, so okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So we'll see how that goes. Yeah. Uh, I found a four-star fighting type porthole. Ooh, Torkoal. Yeah, I remember Torkoal. that guy. Yeah, sure. He's let's from do Owen. It. He's he's one of my boys. Yeah, in the in the show, I believe he goes uh, Torkoal. Torkoal. He sounds, sounds, like, sounds like he's been smoking for fifty years. Yeah, and then, <laughs> and then the smoke comes out of what his back and his nose and yeah. stuff. I think I think Ash had a Torkoal at one point. I'm pretty. Sure, yeah, I think so. No. I think so. Um, have you watched any of Pokemon Journeys? Nothing, not not a Nothing. single like. But I, I mean, ma major spoilers. I heard uh, somebody won. Oh, somebody did win. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It was all over the internet. You couldn't you couldn't go anywhere without finding uh, finding out who won. <laughs> Ash is the champion. Oh. Said, Ooh, we're using Salamance. Yeah, new boy. Let's go. So like, uh, do they just quit now? He's he's the He's the leader. He's done. Well, here's, here's, here's the thing. Ash has been on this Pokemon journey for 25 plus years. He's been 10 for, yeah, 25 years. He's been 10 for a long time. I think he deserves to grow up and head off into sunset. So they've been, they've been slowly introducing Go, right? Like this new young protagonist. Oh. And, and I think that they could give him... 
like, mm. I, I, but that also they could like they could do a older like what if we did like a Pokemon but make it a two thousand like, <laughs> like <laughs> if we age it up we add the drama we like you know we we, uh, we make this a little bit uh, more exciting he for gets, like, for Lado to fight like, Pikachu and he's like stuck in the hospital for a couple of weeks. So. Yeah, exactly. Pikachu doesn't know if he's gonna survive and she's up there and it's professing to undying love for her. They actually get together. It's all it's uh yeah yeah yeah. I think that we could uh we could definitely go uh, into a more adult realm of Pokemon and he would, uh, everyone would still be here for it. Yeah. Well, you better go hit up your agent and say, I got an idea. And say, Excuse me, what the, what the fuck? <laughs> what, is the what is Pokemon, huh? Yeah, exactly. I, like, uh, I don't know if this is going to really play well here in Alberta. But essentially not uh, the region for everything. I think Nintendo is sending us a cease and desist right now. Yeah, exactly. They're like, hmm, what is this Alberta stuff that we try to you know, <laughs> use our name and our, our likeness? Why is Pikachu big? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, have you seen the type of Pikachu dog? Uh, oh yeah, I saw the type of Pikachu. Yeah. I feel like I feel like that is that is like heading in the direction of like a, a more adult like Pokemon franchise. Sure. Yeah. It right. wasn't like super <laughs> cool. or yeah. like a. It was, it's not like an X rated or anything, but it definitely it moved to like a bit more of a. a yeah, like people could get hurt. You know? Right. Yeah, people could actually get injured. I, I, I'll be honest. I, I thought the twist at the end was pretty lame. Like I would be okay if what is, the dad was the Pikachu oh. the whole time, right? Is that? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I didn't do that. I didn't do that for twenty minutes. Yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> but no, it was cute. And like the but graphics. Was power, like, yeah. Like, the graphics and stuff. I thought they were neat. I think that they weren't. It's not perfect, but if they can move on it and like keep moving in the right direction, I think that it, it's promising for some really great uh, Pokemon. We got a lot of options. You know, they, they have a couple of dollars in their back pocket. They, they can use lots of good stuff. Just a handful, yeah. <laughs> So, mm -hmm. the, when you stream your Chaotix, is this on Twitch or on YouTube? <sighs> Directly on TikTok. You can stream. Oh, yeah, I guess you can, eh? More yeah, boomer. You can, live stream on you can live stream on TikTok. Yes. You, uh... <laughs> More boomer time. You need to have uh, a thousand followers. You've got, what, like um, six or yeah. seven now? Eight, maybe? Nine? I just passed nine today. Wow, congratulations. I know. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My my hope and dream was to get ten by the end of the year. And I have been growing relatively fast recently, so we shall see. I might I might break ten by the end of twenty twenty two, which would be wild. Um I yeah, so I I, I got a thousand followers and then I had access to live stream. I wasn't really using it a bunch, but then I used it to like stream card opening which has been really fun um but you can stream right from your phone yeah on tiktok easy right? and it is it's super easy and it does not take a lot of processing power and it's really high quality like they have invested a lot in using phones for as like streaming services and it makes life really really simple you can also use tiktok live studio which is like a streamlab sort of thing um <laughs> They're like in their uh, custom OBS, but my laptop is not able to manage TikTok Live uh -huh. without crapping out. Like, I do not have enough processing power for it. So, um, what's crazy about this, this whole video game world is that, like, in my current job, I like. I'm saving everything that I have to go to Ethiopia. Like I'm just like putting mm -hmm. aside as much money as possible mm -hmm. for this like big, this big trip. And in my mind, I'm like, oh, this is maybe why having an engineering salary is very valuable because you can have these brand new expensive hobbies <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> all the time and not have to worry about. I'm like, I could just buy, like about a year ago, if I really, really wanted to and thought about it, I could have just bought a new laptop and like I would have been fine. <laughs> but 
I like now I'm like I can't just on a whim buy a new laptop. That's ludicrous. <laughs> I can't do that. Like, who, so who's got the money for that? Exactly. <laughs> but you know, to the same token, sometimes by having like somewhat limited technology, it almost makes you have to get more creative with the limitations yes. that you have, right? Very true. Very true. Boxes around like your creativity can become a huge benefit. Hundo percent. Hundo percent. What the Like uh, I Absolutely. don't, I don't have like uh, Photoshop, but I'm using like what's the the cheaper one? GIMP. Do you remember GIMP? Oh, yeah. Oh man, remember when uh, Mr. Jones in computer oh, class in grade nine? I think I know where you're going. GIMP? Yeah, yeah. And then, <laughs> and then, uh, and then Brandon said, uh, "Well, you got to use the bucket tool." And he was like, "What did you say?" I said, I said bucket. What did you think I said? <laughs> no, I don't remember that, but that's great. Also, you know what? I probably completely overheard that conversation, and grade nine Gideon would not have known what the problem with bucket was. <laughs> I would have been like, he's just talking about a bucket, Mr. Joe. Come on, what's the problem? Yeah, <laughs> you're overreacting. <laughs> oh, that's awesome, man. Yeah. Yeah, it's been good. I think, uh, so I've, um, I think I've got to set up, speaking of, like, pre like limited resources forcing creative solutions, I do think I have a setup that is going to work for this, uh, for, like, to stream Pokemon. Okay. Because, uh, what I've got currently, I'll send you a photo, actually. I'll send you a photo on Instagram. Sure, sure. Um, here's how I'm playing Pokemon on my computer. As we speak. Wait, here, uh Yeah, there we go. And what's your what's your TikTok name again for all the oh. all the world that would love to follow along? This is uh it's Chaotic Futures. Chaotic Futures with uh, like Chaotic regular Futures. spelt? Regularly spelt, uh, and I don't think I have any dots or dashes or anything. It's just Chaotic Futures. And if I'm spelling that right, that is C-H-A-O-T-I-C-F-U-T-U-R-E-S. Chaotic Futures Bingo. on TikTok. Bingo. Nice. Absolutely. Oh, that... look at that. Wow. Nice setup you right? got there. And... Thanks, man. Yeah, so... Uh... On the left-hand side of the screen, you see, like, a vertical sort of, like, layout. Mm -hmm. um, I actually, like, I'll probably go live tomorrow while I try to take down the Elite Four. Mm -hmm. And I will be, like, just using my phone to film the left-hand side of my screen. Ah! And <laughs> right? So, like, I'm using my webcam off my laptop, and I have OBS set up in front of me with like the smaller version of my like game footage right there on the left but then i'm playing off of the full game footage on the right, right. yeah yeah no, it, it's, okay. it's, it's like, nice to have the full game footage for sure oh yeah absolutely because that's the that's the one issue i think with uh streaming on tiktok is that the the vertical format is very limiting when you're playing games that are meant to be played in my game. <laughs> the screen's too small yeah, exactly. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet, man. Well, you know, it's uh, it's getting close to my bedtime because I'm an old boomer. But, Heck yeah. Uh, do, you, do you see maybe one more raid we might want to do? I, I am looking for one at the moment. Okay. Uh, do you have any on your screen? I will, I will keep looking, too. I think there's only so much I can explore without... With the wings and stuff and the climbing. Right, yet. that's fair. That's but I'm, fair. I'm wandering, I'm looking. I am. I think I'm heading in the right direction. Yeah. I'm. No, I'm not heading in the right direction. Oh, oh, here's a question for you. Can can you catch more gimme ghouls? Because I killed the first one. I missed it. Oh, yes, you can. There are more gimme ghouls to catch. Hell yeah, okay. So there are more around here. <laughs> Let's get, right, I'm in a section of the map where there are not a lot of raids. Let me fly to a section where I have, where there are a ton. Oh, I still have focus centers that I haven't been to. 
Oh, really? Oh, d does that yeah. mean, like, do you have to talk to them so then if you get, like, knocked out, you'll, like, auto-go to those ones? E exactly. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah, they're spawn points, but you can't fly there unless you visit the bear, like, physically. Oh, this one? Yeah, I don't know about this. It's a one-star, what is it, a Finion? Finion? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. poison, I'm like, yeah. Uh, I've got a metal or steel. Oh, I've got a steel type salamance four stop. Well, hell yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. <laughs> Does this game still have the uh, mystery trades? Is that in this one? Oh, maybe. Okay, because because in Sword and Shield they have this thing called mystery trade, where literally you would just go into your box. You would just pick yep. anything, just anything you had, and it would just randomly trade with somebody else who also picked something. Oh, wow. Yeah, and, like, sometimes, you know, Magikarp for Magikarp. Okay, cool. Um, but other times, like, I know they're, like, hacked Pokemon, and some people don't like that, but, like, I would trade, like, a Magikarp and get, like, a level 100 shiny Salamance, and I'm like, yeah, I'm okay what? with that. That's cool. That sounds, that's awesome. Yeah. That's wild. So yeah, see, we gotta see if that features on there. Uh, Let's do it. Yeah. Okay. Oh what? That salamander is that hot? That's so cool. Big old weight on his back. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, he does. Oh my god. Yeah, he's an ass back. I got that. I got that. Oh. Oh yeah, that was my other question. From what you've seen. Like, if you Terrasquai steel type, does everybody have the axe if they're steel type Terrasquai? Is it all the same path? Okay. Yes. Yeah, it's always the same path. Um, so, like, if you Terrasquai Earth, like, you have a certain like, 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 globe hat. The fire hat is always the chandelier. Okay. Like, in the air, right? Um, about the beauty of the beast. <laughs> uh, the uh, water type hat is always the chandelier thingy. Okay. Yeah. yeah, and the psychic hat is like a third eye, like a stick. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> third eye? Third eye. Third eye. Third eye. Oh, he's confused. That oh, boy is ooh. confused. Critical Oh, Machi's dead. Well, oh, no. I did Machi. We'll, we'll hold down the port. He snapped, he snapped out of his confusion. Yo, he's got Moxie, bro. <laughs> yeah. This guy. Quick. Oh, no. oh, 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 you named him T'Challa. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I did. I nice. Have <laughs> you seen the new Wakanda Forever? I have not, but uh, I've been meaning to. I would highly recommend it. It's very fun. Very fun. Uh, Beth and I had tickets to the and then she got sick, so we held off for like a week and a half. And I was working so hard to not have spoilers. Right. And I worked so hard to keep me not have spoilers. And it was like fully out and available to the public. Um, and it was so worth it. It was so worth it. If the movie was good, I'm sure it would have been good if I had like, watched it. Yeah, yeah, everything. But it was amazing to go like, not knowing what was going to happen. It was awesome. That's what I've really liked with, um, like, even with, like, Pokemon and stuff. Like, I, I have not oh, seen yeah. the whole Pokedex. Like, I don't know what anything looks like. Nice. Oh, shoot. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Dang it. No. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, let's see if we can do this, guys. The spell's back. We need to... You need to like fire? Oh, I fucked up. I picked uh, go all out. <laughs> Figure you guys are strong, bro. Uh -oh. I'm sorry. I, sh I should have used overheat earlier in the game. I thought I would have uh, just wanted to hold off, but that wasn't the right move. I don't know. I mean, over over overheat, you lose all your special attack, right? I, I lose all my. Oh, yeah. I lose all my. Well, you know what? We got one Salamance, and uh, that's perfect. And you got a ton. You got a ton of large candies that you'll be able to use for uh, shenanigans. Go take on the gyms, <laughs> my friend. Yeah, man. I think. Uh, yeah, I, I think. 
Okay, so I filmed, like, I recorded an episode earlier today. I haven't uploaded it yet. Oh, sweet. And uh, I was just trying to fight a terastalized diglet. It was level 17, <laughs> and it, like, pretty much wiped out my entire party, and we were struggling. No. So Wait, oh, now we're ready. In the wild? Yeah, yeah. Gotcha. So now we're, now we're cooking with gas, dude. Yeah, we are. <laughs> it's going to be great. Yeah. But again, uh, always a pleasure, Gideon. Thanks for your time. Uh, yeah, Chaotic Futures. That's the place to be. Check it out on Absolutely. TikTok. He's going to be streaming when are you joining, stuff. When are you joining TikTok, my friend? Oh, uh, I guess. Uh, <laughs> we got, we, we gotta, next, next time we're online, we're going to talk about your, your strategy. I'm, your, I'm now your digital marketing friend. That's what I do. <laughs> All right. And then once we get the ad revenue, we'll, we'll get the... What you, we got to sign a contract? You'll get some dividends or something, you know? Absolutely, dude! I made twenty bucks on I made twenty bucks on a live once. Really? I had a bunch of people come through. I was opening up chaotic cards. Yeah. And uh, someone like dropped a bunch of like little emotes, uh, like you do on Twitch, yeah. like in in my chat. Twenty bucks. I was like streaming for an hour, and that's like so, bro. I'm a professional now. It's wow. wild. TikTok's the place to be, my friend. It's uh, it's changing lives over there. Give China your data, and it will pay. They will pay you nicely. <laughs> We're gonna go from beer money to rent money. I can see it now. Right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> right on. Well, thanks again, man. Really appreciate your time, and uh, yeah, well, hopefully let, let's uh, do this again before you fly out. I would love that. That'd be good. Hit me up tomorrow. I've got some time in the afternoon if you're free. Uh, and uh, definitely like week e weeknight evenings. If you ever got a, a chance and you're not at the hospital saving lives, let me know. <laughs> Sounds awesome, dude. Well, you have a, you have a wonderful rest of your night. And uh, chat later, yeah? Good night, man. Okay, Cheers. Sweet. See ya. Bye.